welcome back today I'm doing a very simple dish it's um, chicken thighs some cabbage some onion and about half of a red pepper I've got the juice of two oranges because they were tiny little oranges but you can see it's a few probably the juice of one orange would be the same I'm going to use 12 drips in total of Tabasco which is a really delicious delicious um, well I think it's supposed to be a sauce but this just makes it really good the first thing I'm going to do is add a bit of olive oil to the bottom of a baking tray okay I'm going to put in my cabbage that's about half of a small cabbage and you can see it's pretty well chopped up I've got the red pepper and I've got three very small onions this is such an easy dish you'll love this and I put my orange juice on top I said 12 but I need I've got eight chicken thighs I need one drip basically per thigh and the other four go in here so I'm just going to one two three four and that's your 12 but what I need to do is to just mix it well so everything's equally oily maybe a little tiny drop more oil and everything is covered in the sweetness of the orange juice okay so I've got it all pretty well mixed and now what I'm going to do is to take the zest and just this is the orange zest and I'm just going to just sprinkle it on that way when my chicken thighs sit on it um, they will be able to pick the flavors up now I'm gonna take each one and make them look a little bit neater otherwise the skin doesn't match terribly well Oh, well, this one looks pretty good and some are much bigger than others I think if you pay more you get a better choice of sizes but this is a very simple meal very quick right now I'm going to take two three four five six seven eight nine oh eight eight would have done never mind and to that I'm going to add some olive oil and a touch of salt and I'm just going to mix it that's it basically now obviously if you want it hotter you add more Tabasco but be careful because um, not everyone likes it too hot now you can add some pepper but I always think I quite like the Tabasco to be the dominant flavor now I just sit them on top now this is pretty straightforward and it looks impressive when it comes out the oven and it doesn't take very long so I think it's a great meal to share with friends family this is one that isn't quite oh I've got nine that's why oh well it's just as well I had nine drips in isn't it there we are now the orange they're sitting on will perfume the underneath but what you will end up with is some gorgeous flavors for the sake of a couple of minutes I just wash my hands and then I'll pop them in the oven 
you can add herbs you can add garlic you can do whatever you like but this is a really good combination i know it doesn't sound very interesting just orange and tabasco but it really is i promise so i we'll pop them into the oven at 175 and just let them cook that's 175 centigrade and they're going to take about 50 minutes so we'll come back I uh, probably you can serve them very nicely with boiled rice with your usual humble bread boiled potatoes anything anything will go well see you soon well it's been the 50 minutes so that's the problem with this oven it's really steamy and just look at that anyone would be pleased with that isn't that beautiful look how crispy they are on the top and you've got the vegetable and sauce here and can you see if you wanted to thicken your sauce you can pour that off and you can add some corn flour to it and thicken it but I don't particularly like sauces thickened and I think that will work so well with some boiled rice and let's just have a taste just 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 the sauce because it's really hot well it's it's light it's zesty it's everything you would expect it's actually quite sweet and it's savory at the same time and it has got the little kick in it it slowly warms the mouth yes anyone would like this it's not aggressively hot if you wanted that you've got to up your uh, tabasco but then it gets fiery and a lot of people don't like it i can feel the warmth in the back of my throat it is really nice and you can see these are really crispy look that's crispy skin there's no way you wouldn't enjoy this dish and it was really one of the easiest dishes I've made with chicken so enjoy I'm just gonna take this one here because it's tiny and just show you look how soft and moist the whole of that is and you've got the crispy skin here you've got the unctuous sauce and vegetables there's no way you wouldn't enjoy this dish <laughs>